Satellite in space uh, will help us figure out that tricky forecast. It's also going to help us combat climate change. Listen to this. Earth's climate is changing, and one of the clearest signs is rising sea levels in the world's oceans. NASA, in collaboration with NOAA and our European space partners, just launched the first of two satellites that will track sea level height over the next decade. Ivana Setnich is a NASA oceanographer and tells us why this is so important. All the systems on the Earth are so interconnected. So as we're heating up the atmosphere, the ocean starts taking that heat, starts taking 90% of that heat and starts spreading and stretching. And then like you get the melting of the glaciers and stuff and all that stuff comes together and causes the sea level rise. And it might not look important, but you start getting coastal erosion and problems with infrastructure and, and impact on the livelihood. But it's also modifying the climate, it's modifying the weather. And that's where people who are not living in a coast sea as well. Instruments aboard the Sentinel-6 Michael Freilich satellite will be able to measure sea levels within a few centimeters for 90% of oceans around the globe. A twin satellite named Sentinel-6B will join the effort when it launches in 2025. These satellites will also provide atmospheric data that will help improve our weather forecasts. When it comes to the you know usefulness of data on a day-to-day basis, um, Sentinel-6 Michael Freilich is going to be not looking only on the ocean, but also collecting important information about the atmosphere. And once you bring these two together, they're like a perfect suite of information that can feed in weather predictions. So if you want to track a hurricane, for example, you can use that data to see if the hurricane is going to happen, where is it going to be going, is it going to grow, but not just hurricanes, any kind of weather. NASA expects to get data from the satellite as soon as it reaches orbit. The data collected will help scientists all across the globe help fight the effects of climate change.